Learn Excel from Mr. Excel Podcast, episode 2444, an easier way to reverse text. Hey, welcome back to the Mr. Excel Netcast. I'm Bill Jelen. Today, a question from me, actually. Uh, you know, when we're trying to find a word inside some other text, we have two options here. We have find and we have search that work really great. So they, they have no problem finding Jenny, unless Jenny is backwards, right? Then find and search don't have any way to say go backwards. So the question is, how do we reverse text so we can use find or search? And you've seen me do it just recently, three weeks ago, video 2439, uh, switched over into VBA and, and wrote this little loop. Uh, if you watch the Financial Modeling World Cup semifinals, Liana, you know, who was competing head to head with like five minutes left to go, flips over into VBA and has the uh, forethought to name her function, flip it and reverse it. Uh, with this string reverse, which is so much simpler. But during this, Dan Mayo, who was my co-host on the on the show, said, well, you know, you could do this with native functions and you can see me just shaking my head like, no, I'm not gonna be able to do it with native functions because the native functions are too damn confusing. A comment on that, that video from Jose Carlos uh, said, oh no, hey, yeah, you can do it. It's just concat left, right, sequence length. <laughs> I'm like, what? How am I ever going to remember concat left, right, sequence, length? I, I, I'm i not making this up. From 1991 to 1999, I was working in Akron, Ohio, and I had two post-it notes on my wall. One of them was this, just simply trying to nest two functions, how the match goes inside the index. And now it's five functions? Now look, it's not that I can't learn. You know, over the years, I've taken various memory training courses, right? And and one, I remember, taught me how to say the alphabet backwards. Z-Y-N-X-W-V-U-T-S-R-Q-P-O-N-M-L-K-J-I-H-D-F-E-D-C-B-A. Right? And it was just 40 years ago this week that Tommy Two-Tone taught the entire world how to memorize this number. 1981, November 1981. Jetty, 8675309, right? We all still remember that. And so, uh, I... I'm wondering, how am I ever going to remember concat, left, right, sequence, length? Well, it turns out that Tommy Two-Tone is still around. He had a long career in IT. He still plays. Still plays Jenny. And I reached out. And here's his suggestion. Okay, I'm going to teach you how to search and reverse. Repeat after me. Five little words. Concat, left, right, sequence, lend. Your turn. Concat, left, right, sequence, lend. That's how you search in reverse. That's how you turn it around. It's just five little words. Cat, left, right, sequence, then. 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 I think you got it. It's on my next record, music for fellow nerds. Take care of yourself. <laughs> <coughs> can cat left right sequence length well i think i've got it i've got it now now the question is how does this work right how do we take this string and turn it into jenny i've got your number inside starting on the inside the length of a3 is 26. the sequence of 26 gives us the numbers 1 through 26 as a spillable array which is awesome and then the right the right of a3 starting with one then two then three then four works backwards from the uh, end of the string until we get the whole string backwards at the very last one. And then the left, the left uh, gets us the first letter, Jenny, I've got your number, and then concat puts it all together, right? So there is a great way to do it. Five functions, if you can just remember this hot little tune uh, from Tommy Two-Tone. Wait, well, check out my book, Mr. Excel 2021, Unmasking Excel. Uh, lots of great formulas in there, although certainly not the reverse formula. Wouldn't it be simpler if Microsoft just gave us equal reverse? Of course, then we never would have heard this great song, right? Hey, guys, shout out to Tommy Two-Tone. You can find him on Cameo. 
Uh, he'll sing a nice little song for your next birthday, anniversary, whatever. Check it out. Great guy. If you like these videos, please, down below, like, subscribe, ring the bell. Feel free to ask any questions or comments down in the YouTube comments below. Well, hey, I, I want to thank you for stopping by. Thanks to Tommy for uh, agreeing to let me use this song here in this video. We'll see you next time for another netcast from Mr. Excel.